This kind of kids learning or storybook can be a great source of income. You can make passive money by selling kids story on Amazon. And the most important fact is you can create this kind of book without any deep skill. Yes, you can do it, just need a basic knowledge of design. Because AI will help us to create our book. In this video, we will learn the step-by-step -step process of making kids learning book. This is David, and you are watching AI Lockup. Let's dive in. First of all, we need a story. As we are making a storybook for kids, the story should be short and simple with a moral value. If you have a story in your mind then it's great. Otherwise, search on Google for this kind of story. But I will use ChatGPT to generate our story. After coming to ChatGPT, type write a kid's moral story in just 150 words about the friendship between a lion and a monkey here I mention 50 words only for tutorial purposes, you can mention as per your wish. Then enter your story topic and hit the enter button. And here it is. Our story is ready. Now I will enter another prompt to generate image prompts. Simply type, I want to create a kid's storybook with this story. Can you please help me by generating prompts to generate images for every scene? ChatGPT generates image prompts for us. And the prompts are really amazing. But there is a catch. I generate the prompts with GPT-4, and it's paid. If you are using the free version then your result might be like this one. It mentions the character's main in prompts but there is no character description. To solve this issue, just enter another prompt, please add their description after every character. After that, enter an example like me and hit the enter button. And our image prompt is ready. Now let's move forward to the next step. After generating the story, now it's time to generate the image and book layout. And to do this I will use Canva. Canva is a well-known tool for designers. Now it's become more powerful with various AI tools. Alongside their own AI feature like Magic Media, you can use a vast number of third-party popular AI tools like Dully, Muff, Heijin, DubDub, and many more. For example, if you want to use Avatar by DubDub, select the tool. After that, create a new design or use an existing design. After creating the design, your interface will be like this one. There are two options to create an avatar, you can generate a voiceover with DubDub or upload your existing audio clip. First of all, click on sign in to DubDub from here and then log in or create a new account on DubDub. After that, to generate a voiceover with DubDub, select a voice actor from here. Click on see all from here to find all the voiceovers. You can use a filter to find the best one. Set your language, style, gender, and age. After that, listen to some of them and select the best one. After selecting the voice actor, enter your script. Next, select a style or emotion. Then adjust pitch and speed. And in the end, select an avatar from here. After all is set, you can hear the preview of your audio. In the heart of a lush jungle, Leo the lion felt lonely. If you are satisfied, then click on generate talking photo from here. It will take some time. And here it is our avatar video is ready. Now you can use it on your video. In the heart of a lush jungle, Leo the lion felt lonely. Reigning supreme but without a friend. One sunny day, he heard Max the monkey chattering away. Trapped under a fallen branch. Despite their differences, Leo used his strength to free Max. Expecting nothing in return. Alright, let's move to the kids' storybook creation journey. Come to the Canva homepage and then search for the storybook in the search bar. You will find a vast number of storybook templates. I will suggest to start with blank. And this is our storybook creator page, first of all, change the background of the page. Now we want to add a frame to place pictures related to our story inside it. Go to the Elements section then open the Frame section. After that open the Blob section. I will use these shapes in my book to place the image inside. Now browse these many shapes then add the one you like. Next, add the first section of a story as text on the first page. Now change the font type of the text to Comic Sans. In this way, I complete the creation of the rest of the pages of the story. Next, 
Add storylines on each page in an appropriate manner. The next step is to add decoration to the pages. Open the elements section then type a lion in the search box. We will add one of these cute pictures from the graphics section to the front page. After that open the transparency and reduce the value to 40. We want to make the image of this lion transparent behind the text to give aesthetics to the page. In this way continue adding interesting shapes and images to the rest of the pages then make them semi-transparent. Alright, our pages are ready. Now we have to generate images with the prompts and insert them on the frame. We will now use Canvas Free Image Generator. Open the Applications section on the left. Now search for Magic Media on the search bar. After getting the search result, select the Magic Media tool. Here you can generate images or videos from text prompts. First, we have to select an art style, let's try with the 3D option. After selecting the art style, go back to ChatGPT and copy the first image prompt, then paste it into the Canva prompt box. After that, you can change the aspect ratio. After all is set, hit the Generate Image button from here. It will take some time to generate the image. And here it is. Canva Magic Media generates four images for us. Select one of them. You can see, the art style is not perfect for us. Let's try with another style. This time I will go with the dream style. OK, hit the Generate Image button. And here it is. This time it generates better images. Simply drag and drop one image into the frame. You can adjust the size if needed. After completing the first page, go back to ChatGPT again, copy the second scene, and generate images with the same setting. Insert the best image into the second page frame. In this way, generates images for every scene and inserts them into the frame. We have successfully completed creating the story. To make the story a book flip, click the share button at the top. Then press the more button. Scroll down, then from the design section, choose simple booklet flip. Now you may have to connect to your account if you are new to simple booklet flip. After creating an account simply press save from here. And our book has been published. Now to review the book, simply click on view in simple booklet flip from here. Now choose a flip type and then click on the convert button from here. And here it is. You can see, how beautiful it's looking. Alright, to save the book as a PDF file, come to Canva and then click on the Share button, and then click on the Download button. Select PDF as the file type and then hit the Download button. And our PDF is ready. Now you can publish the storybook on Amazon and make money by selling it. Alright friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear about your experience of creating a kid's storybook with AI. Share your thoughts and results in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating!